Hello, welcome. Take a moment, pause the video, read the problem, and then press play when you're ready to solve it with me. Okay, so it says here that an investor buys 350 shares of a risky stock for $18 a share. Okay, it's a lot of shares of that stock. Okay, why are you buying it? Anyway, she estimates that the probability the stock will rise in value to $40 a share is 0.2. All right, so I'm thinking 40 minus 18. That means it went up as a profit of $22, right? 40 minus 18 is 22. And there's a 0.2 chance of that happening. So there's a 0.2 chance that you profit $22. And there's a probability that it'll fall to $8 a share. Oh, boy. So... 18, um, right this way, 8 minus 18, that's a $10 loss, negative 10. So there is, that's 80%, there's an 80% chance that you will lose $10. Find the expected value of her profit. I'm assuming in total here, so I'm going to multiply the whole thing by 350. And this will give me the total weight of what's happening. And I, I kind of broke it down per share. And then I'm going to scale it up to 350, but you could definitely distribute the 350 first and find out overall what her total losses and gains would be. I just find it a little bit easier to set it up like this. And then we just do the calculations, right? We've got 22 times 0.2, 20% of 22 is 4.4, .4, and then minus 8 times 350. So 4.4 .4 minus 8 is negative 3.6, I believe. Yep. Times 350 overall, we should expect to lose $1,260. So that's our expected value. So minus 1260 is the expected value of the profit. You're losing $1,260. All right, I hope that helped.